Hi friends, welcome to another video. In this video, we are going to see the preparation of pure coconut oil from the coconut. Obviously, it's from the coconut. <laughs> uh, already here, we can see the climber, coconut climber has come and he has uh, put a lot of coconuts which are good, uh, which are new, uh, green coconuts and also the older ones which were staying on the uh, coconut tree. Here you can see a lot of old ones which were uh, already we have kept and uh, also the other new ones here which the person has seen. So we have removed the coconut uh, from the coconut coconut uh, outer cover and we have uh, made it. So there are a lot of coconuts which uh, we have kept and uh, due to rain also some of the coconuts were infected so here what we are going to see do is that we are going to remove the covers and we are going to dry out the things and we are going to prepare the coconut pure coconut oil so you can you could see that the coconut uh, things are broken out and the shells are there and which everything from a to z the coconuts are really useful what you can use this coconut and you, coconut shell and you can do for cooking or if you sell also uh, it will be uh, you can sell that coconut also you can see how the water coconut or uh, water are there there can be different purposes for which this coconut oil can be used some use for facial and there are a lot of other varieties of the things for cooking the people will be using something and also you can uh, just uh, filter this uh, dries out and you can just uh, use it for other purposes and also you can see the coconut out outside shell and this is the process in which first we are using the machine and we are removing the outer layer of the coconut which is a big process when there are hundreds of coconuts to be uh, taken out and where the oil will be prepared so we are some of the coconuts we haven't uh, removed the outer uh, top layer and we are what we need to do is that first process is that just take the coconut and just uh, remove the shell and covers or the or the layers which are on top of that and we are going to break this one and collect the water if you require uh, to this whatever the level you want and we can just make it to dry the thing so the process is reported for every coconuts and some uh, coconuts as we showed earlier th which are totally a dry out there will be no water inside that so it will um, it can be made into a very good coconut oil okay so it can be dried out also easily some others are little bit fresh and there will be water inside that and which might take few days uh, to dry out the process might be taking some time also uh, so the overall process is a little bit headache and we need to uh, stay for at least three to four days or one week at least so you can get at the end of the product but the end of the product what we get is really a good pure coconut oil there will be no adulteration so we have kept like this so the water at the uh, top will get removed out or dried out so the other things are like the remaining jackfruit season so we have the jackfruit seed which can be used for other curries and all so we have uh, removed every cook we have broken the every coconut and we have taken it out and we are going to uh, make it in the uh, in the sun and we are protecting it with uh, the thin layer of the cover so it can get a good dry heat so you can see for some of the coconuts the shell over the shell over there is removed already so it is easy to remove the shell for the new coconut uh, things it is little bit hard when they get dry out only we can just remove it either you can use the knife to remove that process we explain we will let you know or you can see in the thing so here you can see we are arranging all the coconut into a one layer you can segregate and also keep it so it will be easy for you to understand from what are the older which are the older ones and which are the newer ones so you can see the this uh, process where we are breaking the coconut after drying out for some days it might take uh, one or two three or four days also if the coconuts are not dried out so we are making it into another smaller parts so some of the uh, machines uh, are cutting it uh, now but we are making it uh, even small over here the machines are not that much developed so we are just making it into small small pieces out and also uh, so it can be dried out more easier other uh, other than the 
the other way in which we are dried out so it the whole layer will get dried out and it will be a just a thick kind of a layer so we are cutting the uh, into small small pieces some might be uh, some might be infected so you just need it to be careful and remove the things out of your uh, combinations what you keep so you it's better to keep the only the good ones and give the keep the rest uh, uh, aside so you will get a very pure coconut oil 100 percentage agmark uh, iso 2000 or 2001 this 2001 okay so you can see over here that uh, the coconuts are broken into a very smaller smaller layers uh, and this can be dried out the in the other layers also so we are taking a blue sheet at the bottom so the it doesn't get infected by the sands or something like that uh, and it will not get uh, a uh, small layers of black layer will be uh, open so we are we need to very carefully protect this one and we need to and some sometimes there can be rains also so you need to be very careful uh, about this one so we you can see all the uh, coconuts are broken into small small uh, things and we are keeping it uh, one one layer one place and we are going to dry it out uh, again this one for a few days okay so we have collected every coconut uh, small, we have cut it into uh, the coconut into a uh, small small things so here you can see the good shapes of the coconut which are made into small layers and i'll show you some of the things infected ones as i told earlier you don't want to take that out you need to take that out uh, out so you can just take the good ones okay so segregate the ones which are very bad so you get a 100 percentage pure coconut oil so uh, just be careful when you are going to take the coconuts out of this one okay so just collect every small small things and you need to say uh, you need to keep it uh, it will be better if you have a terrace you can have a direct sunlight and we came to the mill and we have picked up your auto and the weightage has been uh, doing over here here uh, there it has been around 20 uh, kilos so what the amount of oil we are going to lift so you can see the wastage uh, over here which can also be taken and which can be used uh, for cows or the other animals also you have uh, get the things so at the bottom of the things you are seeing the how the protection process is that what the person will be doing here is that he'll be take picking up the coconut uh, things which were dried out and you can see that at the bottom of the layer there are buckets where the oil has been collected so the process of getting the pure oil it doesn't first at the first instance you can see that the oil is not that clear and all crystal clear so you can see the wastes are collected there is no wastage actually is saying <laughs> from a to z it's a under percent uh, pure thing so at the bottom you can see the layers of the coconut oil has been co uh, collected frequently so again the process will be is that the once he would have taken the coconut and he will be putting it up and then again he will collect this one so it will the machine will suck out all the uh, oils uh, to the most and he will give us the pure coconut oil so the machine will be running for uh, around half an hour according to the coconut number of coconuts you have given uh, and the cost of this also a little bit high we have paid around 300 to 400 rupees and but at the end of the thing we will get around uh, 20 kg or something like that so it depends so you can calculate one kg of coconut oil is around 100 or 150 or sometimes it might be 200 if you roughly calculate it will be around the cost will go to 4000 or something like that but the cost what you are giving for this machine is just 300 to 400 plus your auto rickshaw or if you have your own vehicle you can just carry it out to the mill and the other things so here you can see the coconut oil how the pure coconut oil looks like but at the first time it looks like a, a tidy uh, water on the road so you need to make this uh, into uh, you can filter this also this is the purest coconut oil okay so we have we can see the coconut oil are filtered out you need to keep it uh, for some time and the waste all the uh, lot will be getting segregated you can see the other uh, process of the uh, things are put into that black pepper uh, for 
storing the for long time okay so you can see the coconut oil preparation it's very good and you can store it for a long time and thanks for watching this video and this is your cameraman behind the scene and you can see the wonderful coconut oil and hope you enjoyed the video do please comments and give your suggestions if anything possible thanks again for watching our video thanks a lot bye